This morning, Rain Dove, a 28-year-old self-described non-binary model, is the latest person to step forward in the real-life drama surrounding actress Asia Argento, speaking out for the first time after Rose McGowan identified Dove as the person communicating with Argento in potentially incriminating text messages leaked to TMZ. Um, I was not the person who leaked them to TMZ. Uh, I just wanted them to be a part of the legal process going forward. In one of the texts reportedly written by Argento, she appears to admit to having sex with actor Jimmy Bennett when he was a minor. Argento and Bennett met on the set of a movie when he was seven years old, and she was 27. The actress had forcefully denied the accusations that she had had sex with Bennett when he was 17, first reported by the New York Times. When it became apparent that they were not going to allow for um, justice to occur or for um, truth to be on the table, I, I knew I had no choice but to go forward because otherwise I would be complicit and I would be robbing another individual of their um, ability to be heard in their story. An outspoken figure in the Me Too movement, Dove turned the text exchange over to police. I'm not, I'm not anti-Asia or um, anti-anything. I just, I believe that Jimmy Bennett deserves to have justice and I, do, I believe that due process um, deserves to happen. Dove describes keeping in touch with Argento after meeting her for the first time in the days following the death of her boyfriend, Anthony Bourdain. McGowan, who's been dating Dove, says she introduced the pair. Asia had mentioned that one of the things that is difficult in their life right now is that, um, you know, with Anthony passing, um, there was a huge gap and that this individual had helped them out through a lot of things in life. And one of the things they'd helped them out with it was a, an extortion case in which an individual was extorting um, Asia for $10,000 a month. Dove and McGowan later finding out Argento was referring to the nearly $400,000 Argento says Bourdain paid Bennett in exchange for his silence. Amid the shocking allegations against Argento, McGowan now distancing herself from the woman she once stood beside on the front lines of the Me Too movement. Dove hoping Argento can be a voice in the movement again one day. Hopefully healing can occur rehabilitation and they can go back to being um, an advocate for so many people and I really hope that that's the case for um, for Asia because they were a very powerful advocate at one point um, in this movement. Neither Argento nor Bennett have commented about these texts. For today, Stephanie Gosk, NBC News, New York.